Como ya la vi Solita pues me pregunté ¿Qué pasa cuando me bailó? Cerquita Eso fue descomunal Dale, dale, tra, tra Tú sabes cómo es Cómo se lo mando all right, real quick before we get started and I get in my zone, I wanted to show you guys. Here are my palettes. They are new. I purchased them from a company out here in Phoenix. Um, they were $160. Um, I do not regret spending that money on these just because they are treated. They are new. Uh, I don't have to worry about bugs or anything like that. So. Yeah, and then I feel like I'm going to have a little less work when it comes to sanding, too. So, there are my babies. I have eight of them. I also have some semi-gloss, some stain, a brush, some plastic paper to put on the, or plastic cloth to put on the floor, a stirring stick, and I have some... Um, sandpaper and it's two packets of these and that's literally it I think I'm gonna bring a towel and I'm just gonna use what I got because yeah I will not be using any like nails or I'm not gonna be doing anything extra I'm literally just gonna set the bed down and hope it stays in place we'll see I don't know I just don't have any tools so yeah, I'm trying to make this a cheap thing and honestly, I don't really know how to use tools. So this is a very simple version, okay? So I hope it looks cute. It's only been an hour and 30 minutes. I'm dying. I got a splinter. I'm full of paint. I mean, stain. Just a hot mess. And my back is killing me. So I guess we'll find out if I finish it. Right now, I was literally just putting this stain on and um, using the sandpaper to sand them down. They're half-assed done, not gonna lie. But I think it's as good as it's gonna get for tonight because I'm tired. So I have set up everything in my living room. My entire house smelled like wood stain. And if you guys have smelled wood stain, it just smells like chemicals. So I knew something was up, right? So I read the ingredients or read the, the back or whatever, the warning. And it said that it can cause brain damage. It can cause all of these crazy things, seizures. I was like, what the fuck? So I stopped what I was doing. I ended the night, I cleaned everything up. And then I tried to ventilate my house. I mean, my little apartment as much as I could. I just didn't want the smell to go into my kid's room. It was just really bad, okay? It was really bad. I didn't have enough sandpaper. I used the wrong type of gloves to uh, stain the wood, so my hands were absorbing the stain, which is dangerous. It, yeah, it, there's a lot of things that I learned that day that I will never do. Number one, I don't give a shit how hot it is outside. 
I will never do something like that inside of my place, ever. So, yeah, uh, yeah, never again. And then I did go shopping for some more stuff, so I'm gonna show you guys what I got real quick, okay? So, number one, I got some safety gloves for when I am sanding the wood, okay? So this is just for sanding. So I'm just gonna sand everything. And then move on to the next thing. Oh wait, let me tell you guys the price on those. 11.84 for the gloves. I got some more sandpaper. Um, I still have some left over from the other day, but I don't think it was gonna be enough. Um, this was 3.27. Uh, I also got a staining pad instead of using a towel, um, a staining pad, and then it comes with gloves, but these gloves are like plastic gloves. I have some too, just in case like these rip, and this was $4.97. And then, I also learned my lesson with the plastic. I need way more plastic. So I ended up getting this little husky plastic uh, cloth, and this was $2.67 for this big old thing. It comes with three. So I'm gonna sand everything, and then I'm gonna put this, lay this down whenever, whenever I start staining. That's it. I think I'm actually ready to do this now. setting my ass off but today is day two of working on this now well technically day three but you guys already know the story but um yesterday i started um sanding i was done sanding i put some plastic i think i'm like the fumes are getting to me getting to my brain right now i gotta go get in the shower but anyway i put plastic down and then i started staining everything honestly on a scale from 1 through 10, it's about a, on like the perfection level, I would say it's like a 7. And that's okay with me, you guys. I'm over it. I'm done staining. I stained yesterday and then I stained today. I want to be done with it because now I have to put the clear coat all over everything. And then get new plastic and whatever. So, let me show you guys what I did. So, they are all stained. I stained the back of most of them, kinda, but I didn't perfect it. I mostly tried to get like the sides because that's going to be the most visible. See, I stained this and then this is the back of one of them and that one didn't stain the same. So it's all going to look a little different, but I don't even care. I think it's, I'm done, like I'm done staining. So now the next part is to just uh, use the... Um, the clear coat on top and then we're good Si que tu amas ese mal pero tu instinto quiere tocar otra piel no es tu culpa baby no es que seas mala sino que te ha ganado el placer
Okay, I am done. Now they're all just drying and then we're gonna set up the bed finally. Okay, so I already let my um, palettes dry and I'm gonna start setting them up in here. Um, not really sure how I'm gonna do it, but we're gonna find out. And then as far as my mattress, I'm gonna go to the store and get like a mattress cover, like with a zipper but like one that covers the entire thing in like a plastic lining so that my mattress isn't touching the wood. Um, I'm also gonna grab some boxes and like some big boxes and um, break them apart and try to set it up on top of the pallets. You'll see, I'll show you guys. You guys, <laughs> I'm so happy. I mean, not gonna lie, it does take over a big part of the room. Let me scoot back so you guys can see. I'm out of breath. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so happy. <laughs> I know I sound like a total nerd right now, but <laughs> I'm so excited. Hi. <laughs> I'm just so happy that I did this on my own and I didn't give up. <laughs> and it turned out so cute. So I'm ready to set it up. Um, I purchased these boxes at Walmart. They're the 22 by 18 by 18 I don't know I just feel like it's like another level of protection uh, with my mattress um, I don't know how I feel about the toxicity of the products that I use to stain the wood I don't feel comfortable with it but I didn't really know what else to use so I used it um, maybe I'm just being way too extra but i don't know i don't know how you guys feel about it but i just need extra protection so there's that i'm about to put the extra waterproof um cover on the bottom part or i think it goes all around and then i'm gonna go ahead and set it up so you guys can see Ya no hay, nadie se compara a tu estadio. 